Hey friends, I've got a first world problem. I've got this cool mini laptop, which is great when I'm working out and about, but the problems start when I get home, and I want to work comfortably from my desk using a keyboard, mouse and monitor. That's because these small laptops these days sacrifice I.O. ports for the sake of looking cool and portability. So in my quest to fix this first world problem, I've come across the perfect solution from Wavelink. It's a USB-C 10G dual 4K 10-in-1 hub. Now I know that's a bit of a mouthful, but believe me, it's worth the hype. We get one USB 2.0 port, and the cool thing is you can connect up to two monitors, one at 4K 60Hz and one at 4K 30Hz. You're also getting one USB-C port with a 10 gigabit connection, which is perfect because I'm always connecting hard drives to my mini laptop. As we all know, we're lucky to get 500 gigabytes with these new laptops. It gives you 85 watts of power delivery via a USB-C port, so you don't even need to connect your power brick to your laptop. One LAN port with a one gigabit connection, which isn't perfect. But to be honest, I'm always using Wi-Fi at home. We also get two USB-A ports with 10 gigabit connections, which is perfect for connecting your mouse and keyboard and even more hard drives. And it doesn't stop there. We're getting two more USB-A ports with a five gigabit connection. Setup is straightforward. You don't need to mess around with downloading any drivers. Just plug in the hub into a spare USB-C port on your laptop. And then if you go into your menu bar, you should see it there, USB billboard device. And of course, once it's connected, you just use it as an extension of your laptop ports. So to start off, let's test out USB transfer speeds. And of course, I'm going to use the fastest port available, which is the 10 gigabit port. And straight away, you can see that USB drive is recognized and you can go right in and look at the contents. So as an indicator of transfer speeds, let's go in and try playing a video. And that came up almost immediately. So that's definitely looking positive. But let's try skipping through in the video and see what happens. Again, almost immediately, fast forwards to the new spot in the video. So, so far so good. Let's actually get some figures by copying a file over from the USB drive to the hard drive on the laptop. Now this is a 450 megabyte video file, and I'm just gonna drag it over to the desktop. The transfer speed is ramping up from 19 megabytes, and I think we're gonna top about 30 megabytes per second. So I'm gonna keep this running just to show you how long it actually takes. It's good to see a consistent speed. If anything, it's ramping up. Of course, transfer speeds will vary depending on your speed of your USB stick. Looks like it's coming to an end. Okay, so that took about 20 seconds. So I'm definitely happy with that, as it was just a regular USB stick. Now let's up the game a bit and try this 2TB SSD from SanDisk. Again, connection is as simple as plugging it into the USB port, and it's recognized before I even put down the hub. Okay, let's select this video file, which is about 500 megabytes. And I'm just going to drag it to the desktop like before. And straight away, you can see the transfer speed is three times as much as a USB stick. And that was all done in probably five seconds. So definitely where you're transferring from makes a difference. So I'm very satisfied with that result. That's more than enough speed for me. Next up, we're going to try populating these HDMI ports on the other side of the USB hub. Now I've got two ultra wide 34 inch screens that I'm going to use, each with a resolution of 3440 by 1440p. And that's plenty of real estate for any content creator. The setup is straightforward. Plug in your HDMI cables for both of your monitors and Windows will do the rest for you. It'll automatically recognize you've got two monitors connected on top of your laptop screen. And you can do all the normal stuff, rearrange your screens, change the resolutions. It's just so useful. With one USB-C cable, you get all this usability. And as you can see, there's no stuttering or flickering with the screens. Okay, let's do a quick unboxing of the Wavelink USB hub. We're getting dual 4K HDMI, 85 watt charging, and 10 gigabit transfer speeds. And below we get a summary of all the ports and speeds. In the box we get the device and various leaflets. You get driver download links, safety and warranty information, and a quick start guide. Now the hub itself is made out of pretty sturdy material. It's metallic. The cable is very flexible. Ports wise we've got USB 2, 2 HDMI at 4K, 160Hz and the other 30Hz, 10 gigabit USB-C and power delivery of 85 watts. To the side we've got the Ethernet port with a 1 gigabit connection. Not the fastest, but it's usable. On the other side of the hub we've got two USB-A ports with 10 gigabits and two USB-A with 5 gigabits. So friends, the Wavelink 10-in-1 docking station is an absolute game changer. It's got everything, USB ports, dual 4K monitor support, Ethernet, you name it, this thing does it all. It literally transforms your laptop into the ultimate powerhouse. So if you are tired of all the messy cables and switching between devices, this is the solution. It's simple, it's powerful, and honestly, it's kind of insane how much it packs in.